I'm just really sad. I just really want clear skin. I think it's time to start Curology. This is my bottle. I'm gonna be trying it and see what it does for my face. Really my goal with this is to clear up my skin by next year because I just, I'm 22. I want clear skin. I don't know what's going wrong. This is kind of my like last ditch effort. I got it a couple days ago, but I got it like on, I think on the day that my skin broke out. So I'm like, oh wait, shoot, I don't want to do it immediately. And I actually contacted my skincare provider and asked him because you can like do consultations. So I was like, hey, my face just like broke out with an allergic reaction um, all over. Should I wait? to start Curology or can I go ahead and do it? And he said to wait until my skin is back to baseline. And I would say that it's basically there. Here, there's still some bumpiness, but now I think mostly it's just like dry patches that are just gonna slough off as my skin regenerates. With the trial, you can do just the super bottle, I believe, or you can do the three-step system. I figured to kind of get the most out of it and use it as they intended. I wanna do the three-step system using their uh, cleanser and moisturizer. I did like take them out and like look at them. And this bottle is actually mostly empty. Like, I don't know if you can see in there. The bottle is only like half full, basically, which is weird to me. So they recommend that you cleanse and then do the super bottle and then moisturize on top to help lock it in. This is my super bottle. It has my name on it. Um, and my prescription was lindamycin 1%, azelaic acid 9%, tretinoin 0.009%. So I've used Curology for three nights in a row now. Uh, tonight will be night four, but I just wanted to check in with my skin. It's I feel like my skin looks a lot better. I haven't, I had like one like new whitehead uh, pop up, uh, but besides that, I haven't really had any new breakouts. However, it has been like drying out my skin uh, quite a bit. And I feel like the moisturizer that Curology uh, gave me is like not really that moisturizing, at least not at all compared to the Lush moisturizers that I'm used to using. So like I'll put on the super bottle and then I'll put on the moisturizer and then I'll go and get in bed. And like two minutes later, I'm like, oh, my face feels so dry. Uh, but I've just been doing that and my nose is starting to flake. A while since I've used a, a very like chemical acne medication thing because I've mostly been doing natural methods for the last few years. I'm remembering now that like the last, uh, like years ago when I did try like acne medications that they did kind of make my skin feel like tighter and drier and flakier. So it seems to be pretty normal for me. Hopefully that'll kind of like settle out in the next few days or weeks. But yeah, I feel like my skin looks better. I can't really explain why. I just feel like it does. So three days into it, I'm pretty happy with it so far. So it's day seven of using Curology. Um, I've now applied it six times, if that makes sense. My skin is just like looking so good. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm still like healing some like acne scars down here. I had this little like pimple pop up last night, but overall my skin is just kind of like glowing and super smooth. I feel like the kind of red splotchiness and just like the color of my face wasn't super even and I feel like that's evening out a lot. I feel like I just look really good. Wow. I'm like very happy with it so far. Like yeah, still still healing these like breakouts on my neck and around my chin. But overall, I'm like really happy with the results so far. I know that some people like in the second week start to have worse skin. So I am concerned because that second week is coming up for me. Hopefully it doesn't go too badly. I just realized I haven't updated for a minute. Um, I've been doing Curology for two weeks now 
And as you can see, I'm applying makeup to my face because I, I just like have so much like uneven splotchiness, redness, various breakouts, and I'm just trying to like cover it a bit today because I'm a little self-conscious. I'm hoping that things will start looking up from here because I know like weeks two and three can be a little tough with Curology and I'm just gonna stick it out. I've been doing it consistently every night regardless of anything else and I'm just really hoping this works because I was feeling so good for a bit there and like these areas are like smoothing out a lot so I'm happy with that like texture wise just like this area is improving a lot but my forehead still has like a little bit of like the bumpiness and I'm still getting splotchy breakouts and they're moving kind of further down my chin and neck and I don't really like that so here's hoping okay so it's kind of crazy how fast Curology <clears throat> works on your skin I don't know so it's two days later that was on Tuesday today's Thursday and a lot of my concerns have like died down again still like super smooth I like touched my nose yesterday I was like wow it's so smooth um and I think my forehead like still has some bumpiness but it is going away and the breakouts around my chin and jawline are diminishing slightly and overall I have less splotchiness like obviously I still kind of have my like standard red patch but I'm already a lot happier with my skin than on Tuesday. I'm traveling next week though so I'm kind of concerned how going on an airplane and driving and just traveling in general might affect it but hopefully it'll I'll be okay as long as I stay consistent. So it's been like two weeks since the last update um, and I thought I had taken some progress footage. Turns out I didn't um, but here I'll insert a clip of what my skin looked like last Friday. It's now Wednesday, so it's been almost a week. Hello, welcome to whatever vlog this is. Uh, this is the Midwest Road Trip Adventure Vlog. Yeah, I had a pretty major breakout, as you can see in that clip. Um, just like concentrated here as per normal, and then also some stuff around here. I think it had to do with the fact that I was traveling and my skin just doesn't mesh well with airplane things just like the air is dry and like I try to keep myself moisturized and clean but it just doesn't really mm -mm. airplanes are not nice to my skin so we're kind of back to what I'm used to my skin looking like which is really unfortunate because now it's been a solid month that I've been using Curology so I was hoping to see more results by now um, I did get my refill bottle. I got a two month supply bottle in the mail. Uh, I didn't renew uh, with the moisturizer and cleanser just cause they didn't seem to be anything super special. Uh, so I'm just gonna use those until they run out and then start using a, probably a lush cleanser and moisturizer because I like those. And yeah, so I'm definitely unhappy with the fact that my skin blew out basically, but I'm not surprised either. I was on the road for over a week, being back at home in my normal environment with my normal routine. Hopefully things will clear up and be good and clear up by the end of the year. That was like one of my goals this year. I just want that to happen. Okay, so it's been a little over a week now. I'm in my infinite, infinite mirror. I love this thing. Um, don't love how my skin looks in it though because in, like things are healing but I've had like one or two more new zits and I I don't know man I I'm really bummed because Curology really seemed like it was working for a while but I've now been using this for a month and a half I have not missed a single day like I have not <laughs> because I've been so dedicated to making this work and getting my skin clear by the end of 2019 that I've been doing it every single day legit religiously and things are still not like shaping up like I'm starting to get texture on my skin and like here again like my forehead bumpageness still got bumps I don't know if it's just stress that's making me break out but it's still 
I'm so frustrated because I've seen this work for other people and it was working for me for a bit and now it's not. So I'm just gonna keep using the trial bottle till it runs out and then I'll keep using the regular, the big bottle formula, but if things don't start happening in the next couple weeks, I might just cancel for good. <sighs> I'm just really sad. <laughs> I just really want clear skin. I posted on Twitter the other day, like all I want for Christmas is clear skin. I'm an adult. I shouldn't have to deal with acne. Ugh. It's now Wednesday, December 18th. Yeah, things are still healing, but it seems to be working again. And I finally like, okay, so I accidentally broke the original trial bottle that they sent because I was like, oh, I'm curious like if I can like unscrew it. And I did. Turns out unscrewing the lid just totally ruins the pump. And so like I had screwed it back on and it was pumping it forever and it did not work. But there's basically nothing in there either. So I started using the fresh bottle that they sent, the two month supply, and my skin started tingling again, um, like it did when I was first using Curology. So it actually seems to be working again. See like my forehead has smoothed out significantly again. Um, and these things are healing pretty well. I do notice I have like one or two new pimples coming kind of deep under the skin and another one down here, but most of the other red spots are just healing. So it's December 31st. It's been almost two weeks since that last update. Um, well, tomorrow it'll have been two weeks. Uh, yeah. Wow. Okay. My skin's looking better. I missed like one night or maybe two nights uh, just because of traveling for Christmas. However, didn't really have any major breakouts. It's just, I kind of, I think at this point, it's basically acne scars. My forehead is pretty smooth. Overall, I I don't know. I, I've been pretty satisfied with the results. It's not as like incredible as I think other people's results have been. However, I'm just gonna keep using it because it's been two months and hopefully my skin is adjusted now and will just keep improving. So I thought that last clip was gonna be my last update, but um, my hair came off. Uh, you can watch my shaving head video. And that's kind of the main reason I wanted to get my skin cleared up was to have the confidence to shave my head. And since that last clip, my skin has just been getting better and better. So now that I'm in my second month of Curology, uh, it's now day 63, I think, things are going really well. And everything's clearing up. The acne scars are like diminishing more. My forehead is still pretty smooth. I'm happy with it. I am so glad that it like took a corner at the last minute and that things are going well. I'm probably gonna stick with this for a while. I would recommend it. Um, I hope you were helped by this video and this experience. If you were, please subscribe. My cat is trying to get my attention. Um, and yeah, go drink some water, have a great rest of your night, and let me know what you thought in the comments below. See you guys.